sometimes they do, sometimes they don't, sometimes I get it right away, sometimes I won't. <laughs> I just dropped off my second order, so I made out like 16 and something cents off those two, which is, uh, honestly, it's mostly the tips that make it worth it, if like both of them at least tip $5, I mean, uh, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't, sometimes I get it right away, sometimes I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna write a Dr. Seuss hat all the deliveries, but uh, no, we're about to jump on the highway because I gotta get my booty back over to Target. I am going to attempt to grab a third or uh, no, this would be my fifth order. So it's 9 45 right now, quarter of 10. I have to get the orders there anywhere between 10 and 11, so 11 the latest, all three of the next ones. I have two of them in my car right now and I'm on my way to grab the third because I'm like, okay, well, I grabbed this third, it popped up while I was just dropping these other ones off, but it's going really, really close to these next two, so I don't want to go drop off these next two, go all the way back just to go all the way over there again. I'd rather honestly risk running five minutes late on one of the orders than and shoot them a mess. I'd rather beg for forgiveness than ask for permission kind of things. I look at it like I work for myself, which means I'm trying to make it the most convenient for me. And would, what would be the most convenient is going to Target, which is my closest destination right now. And then shooting over and dropping all three of them off within a half hour of each other. Uh, my one order to pick up just turned into three but they're small, so, and like the, the next drop off, they're for the next drop off window, 11 to 12, but I think because I'm literally about to pull in a target, I'm going to grab it all at once, but I have to run because I was just coming back for one order, um, I might have to come back. I was gonna grab it all at once, but I think a couple of them I actually have to really look for. I'll figure it out when I park. <laughs> when I tell you I need to run, I need to run. I just ended up grabbing all three at once. It was a pain in the butt. Oh my gosh, I'm just trying to figure out which one is like closer to me or what makes the most sense to go to based off of my next two. Oh my gosh, I never ran so fast. The people in this store must think I'm like on crack cocaine because I am literally running and I'm just like grabbing, scanning, grabbing, scanning. Ah, <laughs> uh, shoot. I think one of these is going to be late no matter what. So I'm going to end up doing just my closest one and go from there. It's 1020 right now and three out of five of the orders I have in my car right now need to be there by 11. They're kind of close to each other. They're all in different towns. Uh, but I think I can do it. Because again, they're not like, wait, like I'm not going back and forth from every day I'm in two different states. And uh, so I just did like my Massachusetts order first. Well, secondly, and uh, now I'm shooting further into New Hampshire. But my, uh, my last two orders are also further into New Hampshire. So it's weird. I'm back and forth constantly, but if I have Massachusetts and New Hampshire orders all to get like in, in the same bundle kind of thing, I will, I typically do my Massachusetts orders first because that's heading away from home and then I'll like make my way back into New Hampshire. So that's what I'm doing right now. So it's always, always a little bit of a drive between my Massachusetts drop off unless it's in a particular town, which I don't want to get... I feel like I already gave too much away, but it's in a particular town that's like right on the border of Mass and New Hampshire. Um, so unless it's going there, it's usually a drive from my Mass drop-off to my New Hampshire drop-off. But then once I'm in New Hampshire, it goes pretty quick because again, it's all relatively close. So I am, I am 10 minutes from my next drop-off, so it's going to get me there at 10.33 literally no more than a minute to drop it off i'll be on the road by 10 34. hopefully my next drop off will be like if i can make my next two drop offs no more than 15 minutes away each from each destination i'll make it on time i think i'll be good i think i'll be fine
I think I'll be okay. So I try to do a minimum of 10 orders a day. It sounds like a lot because it is. Um, with, but I know that not every day I'm going to be able to get 10 orders. So I try to treat it like I give myself still you know, a time limit to work so I'm not overworking myself. But I shoot for 10 orders a day. I don't have my kids today so there's no real excuse unless nobody is placing the orders that I shouldn't get that. But it's such a beautiful day out and I want to go home so bad and I want to work on my garden so bad and I got a vlog to edit and like do stuff that I actually want to do and enjoy my day off. off. So I want to enjoy that time too so that's why I'm picking up every order I can right now. However, there are, there are a couple customers I won't shop for though. So I do look at the name when I pick up the order and make sure that it's not, there's only like two of them, um, but I make sure it's not for them because I won't do it, I don't care. I'll drop the order. Um, but everybody so far has been either my preferred members or people I've either done before or whatever. It's been very, uh, it's been very easy so far. So, And I think I've done seven orders, so that only leaves me three for the rest of the day. It's only 10.26 in the morning right now. It would be so nice to be done working by like noon. Oh, enjoy the rest of my day. Yes, please. That's why I really do love working for myself. Um, but again, it's consistency. I don't, my days are not always busy like this, and that's when it gets really, really hard uh, to budget for, so. It is what it is. This is one of my preferred members. Um, so sometimes there's like delivery instructions. I'll turn that off so it's not loud for you guys. Sometimes there's delivery instructions. If not, I just drop it off at the front door. But there's a little option that you can hit like shop items. So it'll show you exactly what's in here. So for this one, just double checking the address, shopped items. So this one has the two pull-ups, water cleaning supplies, and nail file. Okay, okay. So windy out today. All right, so two more 11 to 10 to 11 orders. It's 10:33 right now. I'm just gonna see which one is closer. This one says front door, don't knock or ring doorbell. That's very typical. All right, this one's 15 minutes away. Just gonna start creeping out of their driveway. And the other one is... The other one is 10 minutes away, so I'm gonna do the one that is closer first. Only problem is, <coughs> I don't know which way you want me to turn. I think it's this way. Problem is, okay, I need glasses. <laughs> I'm having a hard time seeing these numbers from far away. Hopefully my next order is less than 15 minutes away. We got here at 10.43, so we took off two minutes of that time, I swear. <laughs> I wasn't speeding. Um, okay, so this is my Huggies and the boys' clothes. Okay. My car beeps, by the way, when I get out because I keep the keys on me in case somebody tries to, like, steal my car or something. They're not going to get very far. <laughs> I'm run, starting to run out of battery, though. Uh, <clears throat> so this one is... Oh, my gosh. It's 14 minutes away. Oh, we're going to just make it. Um... This is my last 11 to 10 to 11 order. I'm gonna get there. Oh my god, I'm gonna get there exactly 11 o'clock. Oh boy, I got stuck behind a truck. I'm good. Oh no, I'm gonna be there at 10:57. I'm still making better time than I thought I was. Um, okay, so this has like the it has a little tykes uh, car seat, a couple of toddler clothing. So I already know where it is in my car. I'm just gonna grab it, throw it up there. <laughs> Obviously nicely. Oh, sugar. I was talking and I passed it. Look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. Look what you just made me. Look what you just did me, 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 me do. Look what you just made me do. I know you made me do what you just made me do. What you just made me do. Okay. Uh. Oh my god, they have goats. It's a little farm. Oh, 
I'm so jealous. Oh, the good thing is my 11 to 12s, now we're gonna be working on it, is 1058. This one happens to be in the same town that we're in and it's only 10 minutes away. Good, let's go do this one. That one order just turned into three, but the good thing is that oh, that's all 10 of my orders. So as soon as I drop these three off, ooh, which two of them were very small, that's why I just grabbed them all at once. But I'll be able to go home after this, but I'm definitely gonna need some lunch. I'm getting really, really hungry, but it's 12 o'clock now. Um, I'm hoping to finish these all and be back home by one o'clock the latest. So I'll take it. I'll enjoy the rest of my day.